back to my channel. My name is Shar, and I post content weekly, uh, lifestyle content. So if you're interested in lifestyle videos, please click the subscribe button down below. Thank you so much for joining me here. Uh, thank you for coming back if you are not new to the channel. And don't forget, like I said, to subscribe, turn on post notification so you never miss a video from me. Okay, so I haven't seen y'all in like a week. I was in LA again for work, and I just didn't bring any any of my content creation stuff so i just had no intentions of trying to record because it never works out <laughs> so i decided to you know just just you know live my life go to work and i would pick the camera up when i got home so i'm home as you can see i'm in the bed and last week um on the last video, which was a little bit of a fail, but we did, I did share that I got the nightstands. So I've also ordered a bunch of stuff on Amazon. I've ordered a bunch of stuff elsewhere and I'm trying to like do my bedroom. I'm in my bedroom right, right now. I could turn y'all around and shit. Well, actually y'all, yeah. the bedroom is very like laundry is on the bed, but it's very, you know, empty. So, um, yeah, I am getting ready to try to start to decorate my bedroom and making it feel more like I want it to feel so that, you know, I can be in here a little bit more often. I want to create like a seating area. The color scheme is going to be neutral. I'm going to pull from the, the nightstands and my headboard are kind of the same color. And then my the rug that I bought is lighter, but has the same grays in it. And I, I want to add like some, you know, some greenery, some plants and stuff in here. I think I'm going to do uh, artificial plants because last time I had a actual plant in here i had gnats in my room and y'all know that that is annoying so anyway um just getting this day started i am getting ready to go and uh get to my wax appointment so i'm gonna go to my wax appointment and then after my wax appointment i'm probably gonna get a smoothie and then i'll go to like home goods ross and other stores just to see what i can find um i also need to finish what i was doing in the living room i have not yet built the the bar cart and i want to go ahead and replace that coffee table i don't think all of that stuff is going to be done in this video but we'll do what we can do and share share it as we go so i will see you guys a little bit later okay y'all so i am done with my appointment now i don't know if there's a place over here for me to get a, a smoothie but i'm gonna see if i can find one and then we're gonna go to you know the usual stores can you guess <laughs> we're gonna go we're most likely gonna go to home goods oh it's gonna rain most likely gonna go to home goods i don't know though it's about to rain but we're most likely gonna go to home goods target i have not been to ross in a long time so i kind of want to go to ross but it's about to rain and i don't like that Shit. Anyway, uh, I hope you guys are having a good Saturday. I hope it's not raining where you live. Um, I'm already outside, so I'm gonna try to continue my errands. Hopefully it doesn't downpour or anything like that. I, I thought there was a place where I can get a smoothie, but it does not look like it. So I hate when this car turns on and turns off. Uh, I'm trying to find where I can get a smoothie from. The only place that I see here is McDonald's and I'm not doing that. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and go over to the shopping center where Home Goods is. I need to turn my GPS on so I'll talk to y'all later. Hey you guys, so as you can see, I just got back in from this store. My lips are dry, I need to put something on them. Um, but I just got back from like my morning errands. I did 
I went to get a wax. Then I went to Target. I went to two Targets because the first Target would not accept my card. Um, sorry. I went to two, two Targets because the first Target wouldn't accept my uh, meal card that I get at work. Um, it kept ringing up like the Target was an optical place, so I have to, I have to go to the same Target uh, to use my my weekly meal budget. Why is this crooked? So oh, here we go. So let's just do a quick haul. We didn't we didn't do too much different from what we usually do. So I'll just start. I, I dropped some of the bags over here, so we'll just start here. So I bought four of these. These are by Threshold, I want to say. No, Hearth and Hand. They're just faux stems, and I bought four of them because I want to put this in, on the entryway table, uh, and I want it to be, like, super full. So I'm hoping that it's going to be, you know, give what I need to give. They were $9.99 each. And then everything in here is from Target. So we don't even have to talk about how many times I went to Target or which Target is from because it's all Target. So let me adjust the camera a little bit. Hopefully I don't miss the sound up like I did last time. Um, got some groceries, a little bit of groceries. I, I need to clean up my act this week. So I got two avocados because I want to make some guac. And then I got some bananas. I'm going to immediately make myself a smoothie after I show y'all this because I'm starving. I'm not really supposed to have... Well, it is not encouraged to have only sparkling water, but I love sparkling water, so I got myself a new bottle since I haven't been using my uh, soda stream. I don't know where my bottle is, so I got this bottle. It's a personal bottle, so I'll just use this whenever I decide that I want to have sparkling water. And I'm also going to be making something with some shrimp. I and some teriyaki sauce, I don't know. So I bought some broccoli florets. I bought two of those. I need to try to figure out snacks that have high protein. This one is one net carb with seven grams of protein per serving, and there's two servings in here. So if I eat the whole thing, I get 14 grams of protein. Um, yeah, I get 14 grams of protein. I haven't tried it yet. I tried the high-key cookies, and I didn't like them, so I'm... I'm not really, you know, I'm not, I don't have that much hope, okay? So we'll see. I'll try them in the China Heights. So I've been loving a blue corn, I think that's what these are. Yes, blue corn tortilla chips. Uh, it doesn't matter the brand. Last time I bought some, I bought them from Target. But I've been enjoying them, so I decided to get some more. And then let's stay with groceries. So in this bag of groceries, I bought some, oh, I bought some beef. So I'm going to use the beef instead of the shrimp and make some kind of situation with broccoli, shrimp, a little jasmine rice staple in the house. I also bought some teriyaki sauce. Um, the carbs on this is not that bad. Five grams of carbs per serving, and one serving is a tablespoon. So I think that's decent enough since I have to make my food per serving. My um, peppers that I bought, these are mini sweet peppers that I bought last time went bad because, of course, I was not here. And my cucumber did as well, so I got some more. Y'all know I like that salad. I think I made it on, on my channel. That salad is really good. Um, I think there's more groceries over here. Uh, what, oh, I bought some passion tea. I bought two of these. I, I usually get the passion tea and the green tea, but I need to limit the amount of caffeine that I have because, you know, I'm not supposed to have so much caffeine. The only caffeine that I usually have on my Celsius and you guys are sitting on those. So I basically bought two packages of the Celsius. I got the one with the peach vibe, the tropical vibe, and Arctic vibe. So I bought two of those. That's basically the, the uh, caffeine that I have every day. I'm trying to live my life. And if I want to enjoy a hot cup of decaf coffee, I need to have some creamer. So I, I bought this. I don't put a ton of it in there. 
uh, it's 35 calories per tablespoon and it's five grams of carbs per tablespoon, no protein, even though it's by Chobani, you would think, you know, it's by a yogurt brand. It would have uh, protein and this is a high protein snack, but of course it has carbs because it is, ter oh no, this is original. So this one doesn't have carbs. So this one is just... Oh, it does have six grams of carbs. There ain't no sugar in it. I thought this was teriyaki. Anyway, 10 grams of protein per serving. One serving is one ounce, and there's two and a half uh, servings in this container. I really just picked this up because for my meal card, I have $60, and I was at like 54 and I was like, let me just grab, I started to grab some M&M's. <laughs> I started to grab some M&M's, y'all, but I was like, okay, just to get the beef jerky because this makes more sense with what I'm trying to do with my everyday eating. Uh, okay, that's the last food item that I got. And then I bought myself, I have never had one of these, but I bought myself a, a duvet, linen blend duvet cover set. I'm gonna have to let y'all know how it goes. This is by the brand Castle Luna. It was 129 I wanna say. Um, and I wanted to get like a darker color, like a, I saw a charcoal gray one, but I wanted it to be more brown. So I decided to get this one. It's like a um, cream khaki color. So I feel like it will go in my room for what I'm trying to do. And I will set up, you know, the additional like throw blankets or whatever to, to meet the, the color scheme that I'm trying to, to meet. I got this, I ordered this yesterday and I got it yesterday. This is something while I'm, you know, trying to get my house together generally, I'm, all, I'm just kind of like all over the place. I'm that lady on that TikTok that starts cleaning her kitchen and finds a sock and then takes the sock to the laundry room and then starts a load of laundry and then finds that, you know, the, uh, the trash can in the laundry room is full that goes to uh, take the trash out. And then, you know, I'm that person that I see a lot of stuff happening everywhere while I'm trying to do one thing. And then I start doing everything at one time. So anyway, long winded thing. But this right here is a thing for my closet that I purchased. I want to, I wish they had a picture of it. But it's basically a acrylic stand that I'm going to put my perfumes on. Right now, they're in like a tray, and I can't see all of them. Um, this is how it's supposed to look when it, when it's finished. This picture right here, I don't know if y'all can see that. This picture right here is what it's supposed to look like when it's done. So like one tier at the top, and then one at the bottom. And I think the, the bottom is bigger than the top. So, yeah. But that is all that I have done today. I went to Home Goods. There was absolutely nothing in there that interests me. I didn't even go to Ross because it started to seem like it was going to rain. It didn't actually start raining. It was just kind of like, you know, missing a little bit. So, yeah, I am going to put this food up and then I'm going to make myself a smoothie. I'm going to sit down for a second and then I'm going to get up and put the clean up my room a little bit and put the uh, the feet on my nightstands. I still need to unbox this nightstand. That's why this box is still here. Uh, but I want to put, I want to clean my room up, like get everything out of there so that I can be ready for when my nights, I mean, my rug comes next week and I have some, I ordered some, a sheet, a couple sheet sets from Amazon today. And I don't know, I ordered some more stuff, but I'm going to get myself some food because it's already 11 o'clock and I have not had anything to eat. So I'm going to make myself a smoothie, a high protein smoothie, take my vitamins, sit down for a second, and then figure out what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. I kind of want to go outside, but it's disgustingly muggy out there. Um, and I'm going outside tomorrow with my aunt for lunch. So I'm tired too. So anyway, I'm rambling. So I will talk to y'all later. I'm getting ready. I might show y'all my smoothie making skills. So stay tuned. <laughs> This was thirsty.
guess what? I just got a package. I just got a package, and in this package is something that I've been struggling to get for the longest time. And I was like, I have to share this on my channel. So y'all don't think y'all probably think it's super basic, but if you are a sneakerhead, you know that these shoes have been released 50, 11 times, and you know, it's just been a struggle trying to get them. And they're like the most basic, basic shoes ever. Um, and these came from eBay. So I will have you know, first of all, eBay had like a sale. Or there was like a flash sale, one day sale, where they were selling these shoes for retail price. Uh, it comes with like their little authentication guarantee situation or whatever. And I'm going to show y'all the box and y'all will automatically know what they are when I show you the box. Uh, so we all know what this box means, right? It's a dunk. And it is pandas. <laughs> I finally got some basic bitch shoes. I have been trying to get these shoes forever. So eBay had, like I said, eBay was running like a thing last week where they were selling these for retail. So on goats, on everywhere else, you know, you can get these for like $150, almost $200. But I was like, I am not paying more than retail for these shoes. So yes, here's a close up. Hey friends, happy Mother's Day. So I am headed to the gym because, you know, gym is life. And then after I leave the gym, I'm going to run a couple of errands. I'm going to go to Trader Joe's because I didn't go yesterday because it was supposed to be like this big thunderstorm and it wasn't. Looks like it's going to be today, but who, whatever, you know, we got to live our lives even if it rains. So I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and get me a bunch of fresh flowers because I have not had fresh flowers in a long time and I might go to Victoria's Secret because I have two $20 off a $50 purchase coupon that I hope that I can use them both at the same time if not I'm just gonna get in line twice okay um, and then you know I don't know I might just shop with shit I left that damn anthropology bag because I'm gonna bring those pants back and get something different but I'll do that in a different day anyway I'm pulling up to the gym I'm not gonna go too hard today I just want to you know my week starts on Sunday so I just kind of want to get my week started it looks like it's pretty it's not empty but it's not as many people as it usually is There's some cans in my back seat the hell I ain't no can collector Anyway, y'all, I just wanted to come in and say, hey, happy Mother's Day to all of the fabulous mothers out there. I hope you guys have an excellent day. I hope you do everything that you want to do. And I hope you get some good food, some good coffee, you know, some good company, just whatever it is that you hoped for today. So I'll see you after the gym. Hey, you guys. So here's an update. I went to Smoothie King after my workout. I am just now leaving Trader Joe's. Everybody and their mama is literally in Trader Joe's. I know it's Mother's Day. I know it's Sunday. But why y'all didn't take y'all mama outside somewhere else? Or why y'all up in here trying to buy all of the flowers? Because y'all was, you know, inconsiderate ass little children and didn't buy your mama Mother's Day stuff in advance. Shit, I kind of wanted to shop around, but I just grabbed me, I don't know, maybe like six dozen flowers. <laughs> and um, because I haven't had, like I said before, I haven't had uh, fresh flowers in my house in a minute since I've been like traveling or whatever. But anyway, I'm rambling. So I am now headed to, there's this shopping center over here, but the stores that I wanted to go to all of them are not open. Lululemon is open, so that is where I'm going to go right now because I deserve. And I feel like I can't work out in any other leggings because these leggings are like so freaking like buttery soft. It is raining a tiny bit. It is not, you know, where I can't enjoy my day. Ooh, Princess Parking, I know that's right. 
um it is not where i can, where i can't enjoy my day I'm still gonna get the stuff done. I want to get done. I think there is a free people right here. I wonder if that's open. If free people is open, I'm gonna free people, and then I am going to go to Lululemon. I was gonna try to go to Victoria's Secret, but they don't open till twelve, and it just turned eleven. Like it's eleven early, eleven o'clock, and I'm not trying to be out like that long. I was gonna go to Home Goods, but it was a fail yesterday. So why would I even try to do it again today? But anyway, let me go do this stuff so I can go back home and finish doing what I need to do in the house. So, see y'all later. Oops. Hey, y'all. So, I just got back from my errands. I think I told y'all a little bit about what I did today. So, I went to the gym. I went to, to Trader Joe's. I went to Lululemon. And I was going to go deliver a package to UPS because I sold a pair of sneakers. But UPS is closed. Um, anyway, so these are the flowers that I got. They actually put them in this little bucket that I think next time I go to Trader Joe's, I'm going to take along with me so that I can put it. It's easier to have your flowers in one of these versus uh, having them in like the Trader Joe's grocery bags. But as you can see here, I got three dozen. I think there's a dozen. Yeah, I got three dozen red roses because why not? And then I got some pink roses, a dozen pink roses. And I got these yellow, I want to say yellow roses. And then I got these white roses. I don't know what. They had a lot of options, so it wasn't like there was a lack of options. But I don't know. These were. I was just feeling these. Uh, this was the vibe that I was feeling. I want to put all of the red ones in one thing. And I think I'm going to put it in this one, this vase. Um, and then the other ones, I think I'm going to mix together. So yeah, I'm obviously going to show you guys that. So this was a gift from me to me. Uh, so I got what? Six dozen roses. Also went and bought myself some new leggings because I am like Lululemon has my heart at this point. Um, so I got this color. I'm in a 12 now y'all. <laughs> I got this color. These are the Align leggings. I have a, a bunch of pairs of Align leggings. Not a bunch. I probably have like, well, I do have a, a bunch, <laughs> a pair of Aligns. But you have to like, I, the reason why I like Aligns is because they're so stretchy and they're super duper buttery. So I have a pair of pink ones. But I think when the with the color, um, they try to make the fabric like squat proof or whatever. So the pink ones are like, thick and I like them but they don't fit like this like the ones that are not double line but I got this color what color is this this is did I put the color on here I don't know what color this is y'all I might look them up on the... obviously we'll be having these links <laughs> on the description box below um the lighting is kind of weird uh but Got a pair of green ones, and then I also got this pair of like taupey lilac color. This is a light color, so I'm wondering why these don't have that like ish issue with the the fabric being super thick. But as you can see, these are super stretchy. So yeah, bought myself two pairs of leggings from Lulu because I I don't know what it is about the leggings. I need to figure out. Who they using so I can create some leggings of my own, okay? Um, anyway, that's all I did today. You know, I figured, you know, I just wanted to go out and like get myself some some something that I really truly wanted today. And I bought my these flowers because I haven't had flowers in the house. But yeah, so I am. I have a lot of stuff to do around the house. I am not doing anything that I don't want to do. So yes, it's Mother's Day, but I am going to be productive and. You know, getting my house together, just, it's like therapeutic. So I'm going to be doing that today. And I'm going to probably come in here and make myself some, some lunch a little bit later. It's going to be after lunchtime, but that's okay. Um, and I might have a glass of wine. I just might have a glass of wine. I don't know. But, yes. So I just wanted to come through and just say hey again. Give y'all an update on where we are for today and then I'll come back a little bit later and show you guys I guess I'll show you guys the flowers after I've put them together you've seen me do this many times so I'm not gonna record it maybe I'll record it I don't know we'll see uh 
yeah, I'm rambling, y'all. So <laughs> I will see you in a minute. myself earlier because I was doing all the things that I wanted to do today but I was starting to feel exhausted so I was like let me sit myself down for a little while so that I can like really enjoy my day uh so I think I after I came from the gym I you know got myself undressed out of the gym clothes or whatever got in the shower or whatever and I um made myself what did I eat I ate something I don't remember what I ate but I decided to just sit in the bed and scroll that's what I felt like doing so I scrolled on TikTok I scrolled on Instagram MJ came and laid in the bed with me um so yeah but now I'm up it is now 6 39 my son will be bringing me dinner because you know it is Mother's Day so I requested some fried catfish Yes, I requested fried catfish and I'm going to enjoy it, okay? So, so I'm up because I'm like, let me hurry up and see what I can get done before he comes with fried catfish because one, I'm not going to be able to eat it all and I want to enjoy it as much as I can and two, like, I don't want to have itis because then, I mean, once I get itis, I'm not going to want to get up and do anything. So I probably have about an hour before he's going to get here, maybe like, hour and a half so what i am going to do what you just saw me do i don't know why i'm zoomed in like this what you just saw me do is like i put the laundry away the laundry that was on the bed that was like the last load of clothes i have like three articles of clothes that are dirty and the clothes that i have on that will need to be washed so i'm super proud of myself because everything is put away the uh i've been washing the sheets and stuff all day so i have sheets in that bag basket and then that uh duvet insert got washed before i left for la so i am going to be taking all of this bedding off of this bed and i am going to be putting on the new bedding i'm also going to be removing sorry for moving y'all i got this new tripod and it's super sturdy anyway <laughs> I am going to be moving that. Oh, I am going to be moving that chair because I got another nightstand that I need to bring in here. And y'all, look what's under the chair. Oh, I probably already showed y'all this, but I have sneakers under the chair that need to go. So I got to figure out what I'm going to do with those. Anyway, I just wanted to come in and, you know, give some voice <laughs> to the video today because I don't know that I have been talking. Oh, yes, I have. Whatever. I just want to come in and let y'all know a status update on what's going on. So I'll just do what I need to do and let y'all watch. All right. All right. See y'all later.
with what I could do so far. So as you can see, I still have the accent pillows over there. They're definitely not going to work with my rug, so we'll figure out somewhere else to put those. They're on the nightstand over there. Uh, but I did put the sheets on and I put the fresh pillowcases and the shams. Um, let me see if I can bring y'all closer so y'all can get the This Casa Luna. Oh, that was a hard smack. This, ca this Casa Luna comfort, I mean not comforter, but duvet set came with like, the, it was like this linen material and it came with these two pillow shams. I got the sheet set from Amazon. It was $39, y'all. I'll let y'all know if it is a good quality sheet set. So far it feels nice after I washed it. You know, sometimes after you wash something, I don't know if it's because like you've used it that it gets like those little balls on it, but so far so good. Um, I need to get my phone off the bed. Like the bed is like fresh and clean and I would see my phone on it. Um, anyway, so we're, we're going to have to decide what we're going to do as far as like accent pillows. But while we don't, oh, and that's off center. So I'm going to have to straighten the pillows anyway. Uh, but while we don't have a rug, my rug is supposed to come on the 23rd. So once the rug comes, then I'll see what I need to do about the pillows. I'm thinking maybe like deep navy or black or something like that just to kind of you know balance out all of the neutral because you can see this nightstand is almost the same color as my headboard the bed itself is like walnut wood it's not even <laughs> it's not even you know i'm hoping that the comforter or the duvet the the top sheet or whatever or the cover Y'all, what am I doing? I'm hoping that once I complete making the bed that it hides that, but at the same time, I really don't care. So yeah, but that's where we are right now. The duvet cover is in the shower. I mean, <laughs> the duvet cover is in the dryer. So once that dries, I will figure out how to put it the insert in y'all been using the duvet insert as like my bedding this whole time i thought it was like a comforter or whatever but it's an insert i didn't know that y'all didn't tell me so whatever anyway i'm gonna take a quick little break and i'm gonna go in the kitchen and see if i can find myself a snack while i wait for my son to bring my dinner and then once the duvet cover is out of the out of the freaking dryer. I keep wanting to say shower. <laughs> Once the duvet cover is out of the shower, I'll come back and we'll put that together and see what it all looks like. Uh, I also want to go ahead and put the other nightstand in the corner that I just cleaned uh, so we can have some feng shui. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Um, I hope this video has not been like all up too all over the place. I'm always all over the place, but that's just, that's just that on that. <laughs> anyway, I'll see y'all in a minute.